I'm, I am a social worker and I do believe that social work is my calling in life. When I was in my early teens, my grandmother was diagnosed with Alzheimer's and um, eventually moved into the home with my parents and my three brothers and I. And I, th I do know that that's when I realized that I wanted to be um, a social worker. So when I got to the acute setting um, and I moved into the um, manager role and eventually the director's role of the care coordination department, I thought about things that my grandmother had experienced and I was able to connect some of those dots and I thought about the fact that we had home health but um, we didn't have anyone to really talk us through the progression of her disease process and what to expect, what's going to happen next, not necessarily hospice, but what what was going on with her and, and to again just connect things for us. And so. Um, I just recall talking with my assistant vice president about palliative care and having, you know, read up on some things, actually the CAPSI um, website, and um, I just remember thinking, you know, this is a good opportunity for our organization because we have um, an aging population, of course, and we have patients that are coming in with long length of stays and and not really self-managing and families who are confused. So it was a question of what can we do to help bridge them.